is going on YouTube? This is my speaking and oh <laughs> Oh my goodness, okay for context. I was just watching the Nintendo Direct They said that they were dropping an Octopad 2 demo and you guys know <laughs> You know that the second it dropped and I downloaded it. I had to play it. Okay. I'm not wasting any time, bro No spoil or, or, or no freaking cute stuff here. No nonsense I'll tell you guys right off the bat as as a sort of celebratory measure for the fact that we know the game is uh, is coming out in a little bit, I'm not even going to play any games with you guys. I'll tell you who I'm starting my journey with. It's going to be Temenos, bro. I thought about whose theme did I like the most. I like Particios the most, but Temenos is second for me. And whose story do I like the most just based off of what we've seen thus far, bro? I got to be honest, bro. I have to be honest. Temenos' story is seeming like the one to me, bro. Your name is Temenos Mistral, and you are a cleric. Your tale begins in the mountainous region of the Crestlands. Though easy going in your duties as Inquisitor, that all changes the day a tragic incident takes place in the church. Oh dear, I suppose it can be helped. After all, doubt is what I do. Sensing that there is much more to the incident than meets the eye, you set out to solve the mystery left in its wake. <laughs> can you guys tell how excited I am, bro? Oh, and you even get different artwork for- Oh, this is too cool, bro. Let's begin, man. Long ago, darkness and confusion reigned. The hearts of the people ran over with wickedness. The world seemed eager to greet its end. Then, eight gods assembled, and with their sacred flame, brought light to the world. The same gods as Octopath 1, perhaps? I'm just guessing. O oh, Elfric, the day is wicked. We give our power to you. You must Stop, Vide. <laughs> so right off the bat, same gods as Octopath 1, and we're actually getting to see them now. And Vide, oh, I guarantee you Vide's final boss material. If she's not the main antagonist, she sounds like a final boss to me. That's all I'm saying. And we get to see Elfric. Elfric proved to be like the most important god. Um, if you've played uh, Champions of the Continent, I actually have not, but I've read a lot of the, you know, the story surrounding that game. Elfric is the man, so I'm not surprised that he is depicted with the most detail out of all of them. Rest well, my fellow gods. I shall put an end to Vide's wickedness. The truth lies in the flame. No mention of Galdera, but a lot of talk of this Vide. Hold B while moving to dash, but beware your chance of encountering enemies is higher. Of course, of course, classic Octopath. Confront the wicked god? Bro, who is Vide? There was no Vide in Octopath 1. Vide. Who is Vide? Do you truly mean to enshroud us in shadow? Now I am become chaos. Devourer of all life in this world. Even you. Foolish gods. All shall be mine. You have made your choice, Vide. And now my righteous flames shall turn you to ash. <laughs> I am freaking out right now. Okay, God skills? Are you serious? 
You better take my wrath, bro. But they've got 99 shields, though. That was definitely Lux, Lux Conjurer from the first game, but we'll let it slide. We'll let it slide. <laughs> guys, okay, you you guys know the deal. I had to record this for you the instant. I knew that they were dropping a freaking demo. Okay, and for that reason, a lot of things may be out of order, okay? I usually show you guys the title of each song that appears in a game the first time we hear it. I can't do that this time because I don't know any of the freaking titles to the songs, okay? There's no way for me to know that because the game has not dropped yet, okay? I literally learned of this demo approximately an hour ago. I'm recording it for you guys now, and I'm hoping to upload it the same night. This is, this is way too hyped for me, bro. Is this the best you can do, Elfric? Enough of this foolishness. I shall devour you as well. Flames aid me. May the sacred flame guide me. I just cannot believe that we're playing as Elfric. Do you get this? This freaking encounter at the start of every traveler's journey, or is this just for Temenos? Oh, that's uh, that's the freaking shadow skill from the sorcerer class. I've seen you that before. Possibly hope to best me. See how the light fades from this world. Oh, you know what I'm thinking? No. Did you say? What did you say again, Alfred? The flame has been entrusted to me. From its humble light shall a fire be lit, shining its light upon the darkness. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Divine resolve. Okay, I was just about to say the, the gods in Octopath 1 were able to seal Galdera, right? But they, 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 they had to have died at some point. What if V-Day was the god who who made sure that that came to pass? My fellow gods, let us illuminate the shadows. Oh, this is too, <laughs> this is too high. This is too freaking cool. Bro, who is V-Day? That's what I need to know. I will engulf this world through the malice of the people. Burn bright, O oh sacred flame, from our hearts. From our hearts. Are you good, Elfric? <sighs> I don't know about this. What was the next line? What? <laughs> you forgot the lines? Elfric, bro. <laughs> we need you right now. Although that seems like some... Some, um... That seems like some stuff that went down in the ancient times, bro. Oh, sacred flame. From our hearts. From our hearts. What was the line again? <sighs> What was the next line? What is going on right now, bro? <laughs> you forgot. It's dried the shadows from our hearts. Ah, yes. My apologies. You've a fine memory, young man. <laughs> Everyone knows how that part goes, Temenos. At least get your own performance right. <laughs> <clears throat> now then. With that foible behind me? Elfric's flames consumed the wicked V-Day. And disaster was averted. The eight gods, their power drained, fell into a long slumber. Is that how it went, bro? Because I have a feeling, I'm just saying, we might encounter V-Day yet again. I, that is just a thought. Just a thought. But that's my opinion. They then became the sacred flame that keeps the darkness at bay. And thus, the people continue to live in light and warmth. For the sacred flame ever shines upon them. That was pretty. 
pretty good, Temenos. Except for the lines you forgot again. <laughs> You're quite a demanding audience. <sighs> when are you going to commit the story to memory, Temenos? Do get a hold of yourself, Inquisitor. I shall, Mint. Now, here are your candles of the Sacred Flame. Return to your homes, light them, and open your hearts. Let their warm glow illuminate every corner of your souls. Thanks, Sister Mint. I like your hair ornament. <laughs> Why, thank you. Hey, I like it too, Mint. What you trying to do after this? You know, I'm free. I don't got anything on my schedule, you know, so I was just wondering. Okay, okay, let me, let me save it. Let me save we it. are all born with shadow inside us. Shadow manifests in our worst instincts. Anger, hatred, resentment, and jealousy, to name a few. But the sacred flame drives these shadows away, leading us to the light. Oh, it's the pontiff! The, po the man himself? His name is Yorg, right? You guys know I watched the trailers like 5,000 times, bro. Ah, your holiness. Please forgive the unruly scene. I've literally watched them so many times. You guys would think I'm obsessed with this game. That's how excited I am for this to release. <laughs> Nonsense. The children seem to be enjoying themselves. And I hit it spot on. Just, just to prove my point. <laughs> I pray that is the case. Might I have a word, Temenos? Uh, yes, of course, Gladly, Pontiff. Bro, we did not hear the, v the, the, the name Vide a single time in Octopath 1. I don't think they're going to introduce that character for freaking any old purpose. I think that's going to be an important figure in the story. Mark my words. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong, bro. But that's my feeling. Temenos, does the village seem at peace? I mean, it, it seems all right to me. Nothing stands out, as it far does. as I know. At a glance. Exactly. But shadows lurk around every corner. That is true. Very true. And that, my son, is why I have a job for you. We've had no major incidents since I appointed you to the Inquisition. However... Since arriving here, I've felt forces mobilizing against the church. Hmm. <laughs> Again, so you guys know how many times I've watched the trailers? <laughs> I know that he said that exact line in the trailer, bro. I, I was not lying to you guys. I've literally watched them like 10,000 times each. I'm obsessed with this game, bro. Now, I know your position as Inquisitor keeps you plenty busy. But I beg you to aid me, Temenos. I know I can trust you. Just as I trusted Roy. And who is Roy? You shower me with undue praise, Pontiff. Did I hear backstory? Who the freak is Roy? Are you two keeping secrets from me? Nah, man. You, you, hey, come right in. Ho, 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 ho. Oh, yes, Mint. Grave secrets. Now then, I must take my leave. I have others waiting on me, you see. Come to the cathedral this evening. I have much to tell you. Understood, your holiness. The truth lies in the flame. that I believe that was Lucian a theologian from the western shore what brings him all the way to meet with the pontiff I wonder is there no end to the pile of secrets in this place mm. 
I've a little while before my meeting with His Holiness. Perhaps a stroll through the town is in order. Oh my gosh. I've taken control of the character in Octopath 2. And unfortunately, Temenelis, bro, do you run faster in this game? Or am I just crazy? This feels fast. I was gonna say, Temenos, as much as I would love to take a stroll through the town, this demo is giving me three hours to cover this freaking stuff. So I gotta do what I gotta do on me. Hmm? What's all this commotion? Listen to me, you fools. The church uses the sacred flame to deceive us. Ah, uh, so you're what we call a heretic, huh? But the truth shall be exposed. The purge begins here and now. Open your eyes. The truth lies within all of us. You are the ones who must open your eyes. Sanctum Knight, are you? <laughs> Newly anointed, but yes. Why do you rage against the sacred flame? I beg you, look inside yourself and repent. You didn't say they'd set the knights upon us. Ah! You, you cowards! Oh. Yo! I'll start the purge with this cleric. That ought to open your eyes. You'll see that the sacred flame protects no one. How dare you! Oh dear. It seems I've been captured. But while we're here, allow me to ask. You're a heretic. Are you not? I mean, clearly, but we move. What? You're a heretic. Oh, sacred flame, shine your light upon us. <laughs> Yo, he hit him with the luminescence. <laughs> Behold, the protection afforded by the sacred flame. Bro. <laughs> oh, you saved us, Temenos. Thank him, not me. Is that the Staff of Judgment? Uh, are you the Inquisitor? That I am. My word, it is an honor to meet you. Only the best among us are chosen to assume the honorable role of Inquisitor. I hope to one day join your ranks. Hmm. You're an unusual fellow. Do you have a burning desire to recount our history ad nauseum? Uh, our history? Indeed. What is your name? Crick, sir. I've been assigned to escort duty at the cathedral. Well now, I can certainly vouch for your swordsmanship. It appears the rumors are true. The heretics are mobilizing against the church. Indeed. The Sacred Guard increases its defenses as we speak. Unbelievable. What are those gods of ours thinking? Peacetime is no time to be lax in your... Did I hear you directing those words at the gods? The very gods you Inquisitors are messengers for. <laughs> there is such a thing as trusting too much, Crick. I dare say even our gods would be relieved at hearing such a frivolous comment from me. I must be dreaming. These cannot be the words of a clergyman. <laughs> Doubt is what I do, Crick. Uh, if you'll excuse me, I must go greet the Pontiff. 
Then you had better turn around. The cathedral's not that way. Please, I've only just been assigned. Goodness, I must admit I fear for you. Come, my little wayward lamb. I shall guide you to the cathedral. W wayward lamb? Path actions, bro. <laughs> oh, this is surreal, bro. When I say surreal, like this is beyond surreal, bro. Oh, I have to select him. I forget that this game changes the uh, it changes the game a little bit. You have to choose the person whose path action you want to use, and then choose if you want to do it or not. Yeah, come this way. We're gonna show you where the freak it is, and you better not forget. <laughs> Uh, and another thing I have to address. Oh, shoot. Danger level. I didn't know that to get to the pond if we had to... Oh, wow. Okay. Well, if we're going to fight, I'm going to be talking to you guys anyways. Because I'm not cutting out the first few. You better bug. Bro, you... You better hear me when I say... I and look at the new battle time. transitions. And we got new enemies. This is something that blew my mind when I saw the trailers. Okay? Apparently... When enemies attack in this game, they have animations, bro. Crazy concept, I know. But that was not a thing in Octopath 1. You have to understand, bro. And of course, I say that, but this enemy has no animation to speak of. <laughs> but that, oh, it just got me so excited for all the things that I'm sure they're going to up the levels on in this game. Like, but, and the new battle theme. Guys, I'm sorry. Of course, I would have always, um, I would have always oh, showed you guys, obviously, that Yasuno Nishiki composed this music, but of course, also, the titles to all of these songs. I, as I said earlier, I can't do that yet. This is a demo, and <laughs> I have no idea, I have no way of knowing uh, what the titles to these songs are. Uh, let me shut up for a second, though. We got a cutscene here. The sun hangs the sun low. Hangs. Oh, he, uh, we can ill afford to dawdle. The beasts grow in number at night. Then we must steel ourselves and proceed with caution. <laughs> You're a stalwart companion. The Sanctum Knights are handpicked from among the church's best. They're even called God's Blade by some, and reportedly capable of felling a thousand beasts. You may trust me with your life, Temenos. This God's Blade is with you. Hmm. Did my eyes deceive me? During that last fight, I was certain. Yes, I do believe you hid behind me the entire time. What? Why, that's preposterous. I swear on my reputation as a knight, I shall protect you. I mean, he was out here, to be then fair. my eyes deceived me, and I meant no disrespect. I hereby place my life in your hands, God's blade. Very good. You'll not catch me hiding, sir. Now then, let us be off. Crick joined the party. And as I was saying, uh, you guys might know, or might not know. <laughs> I can't even speak English. I'm so excited. If you're not a Vice fan, if you, if you don't watch every freaking video I upload, then you might not be aware of this. Um, but I was actually planning on having a face cam for this playthrough, for the playthrough of Octopath Traveler 2. Um, and I announced that, of course, during my Live Alive playthrough, in which I stated, uh, whatever the final episodes of Live Alive will be, I will have a face cam for them, because I wanted to try them out in that playthrough, so that I could know, okay, I, I, this is a, I, I can... You know, I know what the freak oh I'm doing for Idol Patch Traveler 2. <laughs> okay, well, little did I know they would drop a, a freaking demo to this game. I have to give it to you guys day one, and because I'm doing that, <laughs> I have not yet actually recorded those episodes of Live Alive, uh, you know, where I actually try out the face cam. I literally, as I'm speaking right this very moment, I have not set up my face cam. Like, that's how caught off guard I was. Um... Oh, the, the bro, the, the music is just, it's already killing me, bro. 
and this is just the first battle theme, and I'm already just in disbelief. Yasunori Nishiki, you heard me gush about him endlessly in the first playthrough, okay? And if there's one thing I can guarantee, it's that that is not going to change anytime soon. I I apologize if you're sick of freaking me uh, or hearing me say it, bro. But it ain't changing. And that's just the way it is, bro. You may be able to reach places you cannot reach on foot. Take a chance on the pier. Okay. We've seen a lot of this in the trailers, of course. I'll take that accessory. Nothing mind-blowing, but it is kind of cute seeing them move around on the freaking uh, canoes, whatever the heck those are. I have no idea. I, I don't do that type of stuff. Hey, don't expect a lot out of me. Stand back, Seminoles. To battle. See, and, and, and speaking of me gushing about this uh, this composer, Yasunori Nishiki, did you hear? You might not have. But there's a chance you heard that at the start of this battle theme, it played the same old intro that they did in Battle Theme 1 in Octopath 1. The, the same old dun 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 dun. Come on, bro. Like, if you got your ears tuned to it, I know you heard it, bro. That's the type of stuff I'm talking about. Like, those little nods to the past, bro. Those little odes to Octopath 1. I just know that there's going to be so many of those in this game. I'm so excited to experience it, bro. But for now, I'm on a timer. Like, I can't waste time here. Uh, I, I don't know if this is true. I have to assume so. They, t they tell you at the start of this demo. You know, you have three hours to do what you want to do, and then you got to wait, you know, two weeks plus for the actual game to come out. And I'm trying to show you guys as much freaking stuff as I can, so I'm not about to waste my time. And here we are, my lost lamb. I beg you. Cease calling me a lamb of any sort. My name is Crick, and you would do well to remember it. <laughs> My apologies, Crick. As I said, here we are. The Order of the Sacred Flames Cathedral. Are you quite prepared? This is certainly strange. It's locked. Your Holiness, tis I, Temenos. Hello? Are you in there? Would you be so kind as to open the door? I fear I shall catch a sickness. Did the Pontiff truly invite you here? I must say... I'm beginning to doubt you're the Inquisitor at all. Learned to doubt at last, have you? And yes, he himself told me to meet him here this evening. Perhaps something's gone wrong. How about it, Crick? Can a god's blade with one mighty swing... Cut through the door like a damned criminal? Absolutely not! Oh dear. But... So be it. We'll just have to think of another way to get inside. Hmm. Have you hit upon one? Hmm? Can you hear me? Uh, Temenos, we'll catch our death out here if we don't think of something. Inquisitor Temenos! Oh, hello there, Crick. Is everything quite all right? You look dead on your feet. My apologies. I cannot help but concentrate quite deeply when I ponder a problem. <laughs> a bad habit, I admit. <laughs> hmm. Thanks to that bad habit, however... I've thought of something. The cathedral underwent significant repairs two years ago. 
Surely those who assisted with the repairs still live here. Perhaps interrogating them will shed some light on the way forward. Interrogating? What are you planning to do to them? Hey, we don't gotta talk about that. It is what it is. Let us be off. <laughs> Can you see why I chose Temenos first, bro? Everything about his character. I just love it, man. I just love it, bro. At night? Okay, forget the rest of the freaking sentence. At night? Day night system now? Okay, okay, okay. He can coerce information out of townspeople. And uh, we will get right the freak on that. First things first. Let me up in here. Who is this? Why does he look like. No, oh, that's just. Okay, he's just a cleric. He's just a cleric. Time for some questioning. Wait, oh, but I forgot. <laughs> if you want that info, you gotta break him in battle. At least that's what the trailers told me. Oh my gosh, this is just too Very cool. Well. Uh, I don't suspect the cleric will be weak to staves, but I doubt even more that they'd be weak to light. Take that. Yeah, I take that. They, they probably are weak to light. But I, I mean, look how far up the chain the stave is. Like, I'm just saying. Where was I? Oh yeah, man, uh, face cam coming soon. Although that's probably not the most important thing in the world, bro. Just the fact that I'm playing this game right now. I, I, I'm telling you, I cannot believe it. I'm pressing the buttons on my Joy-Con. I'm looking at the screen, and I can't believe it. Even still. He had nothing for us anyways. Man, why would you fight back <laughs> if you had nothing to contribute? Yeah, but I guess if he's going to say, oh, I don't know anything, then we're probably not going to believe him. But you know what? No, I'm not about to coerce this dude. I'm going down here because they would want us to course those two first and then and then put the real where am I going bro what you, you, you see what the I don't even know what to say bro oh yeah oh come on now Vados the architect I will get answers this is what the freak I'm talking about Temenos you better get some <laughs> answers and if anybody's gonna have answers for us I bet you it's Vados the now, give me that info, Vados. Please! <laughs> Vados, I'm about to lose my mind, bro. Oh. The smaller building east of the cathedral hides a subterranean passage no longer in use. Okay. So he did have info, but it said no information gleaned, so I was like... Okay, 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 okay. Blessings of the sacred flame unto you, Vados, for this gift. Blessings unto you, Vados. I, I agree. See, I see. I must say, I did not expect to be heading underground. The path is open, Crick. The path? Which you forcibly opened, despite being a messenger of the gods. And the gods did give their messengers flame to light the way forward. I did as the scriptures bade, Crick. I used the flame vested in me to open the way forward. Forgive us our sins, O oh gods. My goodness. Those of your ilk must lead an exhausting life. And how is it that people of your ilk get chosen to serve on the Inquisition? The Pontiff chooses us. It's quite simple, really. Hmm. The sacred flame flickers. This is an ill omen. What? I am overcome with unease. Nevertheless, we press on. Hey, I heard that, Temenos. We move, man. We do move. And we continue to move in the next episode, bro. For the first time in this playthrough, I got to call it here because recording's at 35 minutes. And I got maybe one or two battles to cut out, bro. So that's just the way it is, bro. We continue on in the next episode. But for now, I'm calling it. So if you guys did enjoy, man, you can always give it a like. If you did not, you can just like and tell me what I can do to improve these episodes in the comments. With all of that said, man, I have been Vice. And this has been... <laughs> 
<laughs> for the first time ever. Octopath Traveler 2, man. I'm going to let that outro do its thing, and I will catch you guys in the next one, all right? I'm out of here, man.